Hello Knight here, welcome back to my Roma Serectum 2 campaign playing as the Roma Republic and we're, we're in the middle of the Civil War. I haven't found Caesar yet, I assume that he's in... he's probably over in Gaul somewhere I'm guessing, massing his forces ready to attack. Although we have a lot of these armies are coming through but don't have generals. A lot of these Imperial armies, these ones over here don't. They literally just have a... a um... oh he's actually got a Legatus. A lot of them don't. Wow, this is these are good troops. <clears throat> yes, indeed, these are are good troops. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's get on with this. I'm sure we can we can do something against them. Uh, they have a couple of units of archers, some pilar. Obviously, the, all their units have pilar. <clears throat> right. Let's go for this. I think we can win. It says we can win. 3 to 1. It really depends how much we lose, but um, let's just see. See, he's pretty much surrounded. So I'm hopeful for a complete victory here. Hopefully we can destroy his whole army. No rush, because we want the other armies to come on and take him in the rear and the flank. Three legions against one. I think I'm gonna, this is the way I'm going to have to play this. Really focus and concentrate my forces against them, um, individual um, legions, imperial legions. Oh, it's I am winter. known as something of a philosopher. Some ask me, why are we here? The answer is often complicated. But today, we are here to kill all those bastards! Today, we go into battle against the Gauls. Warriors both worthy and brave in equal measure. <coughs> Our task today is a noble one. To preserve the town and its people. Yeah, okay, I want to get on with the battle. I'm quite excited about this. Uh, right, spearmen. Spearmen. Okay, I can put them all on the flank, I think. Okay. Legionary cohort. Triarii. Legionary cohort. These guys together. Battle group. Units. Guard position. Okay, that's fine. Got quite a lot of bowmen. Archers. Archer, archer, archer. Archer. Battle group. Units. Units. Stand and guard fight. position. I will actually put the archers in between the. <clears throat> Two units, the two lines of men. <clears throat> so it's kind of a, <clears throat> a slight, <clears throat> excuse me, a slight kind of triple axis, but not really, not really. I'm hopeful these guys can hit them. Can hit the um, the their cavalry. So if we put this here. I suppose it is a triple axis, really. We've got the guys at the rear. Let's start the battle and see see where my armies come Your on. Your reinforcements have arrived. Oh, okay, so there's this no rush, no rush at all. Indeed. Let's move up the road so that the archers can get hold of them. I'll throw the cavalry forwards, actually. Over on the flank, I think. Put these guys over on the flank over here as well. Is he running? He might be running, you know. These heavy infantry. Well, he certainly doesn't know what to do. He's, he's all over the place, basically. Definitely want to get my bowmen involved. How are we doing? We're just 
just hitting these guys at the moment as they march around. Really, I'm not quite sure what they're doing at all, to be honest. Seems to be going in two directions. We should be fresh, I'm not trying to rush any of these guys. Spearman over here. He's running, I think. I think he's trying to get away. Which is not good for us, to be honest. We really need to try and kill them. So at least kill the ballista. He's running away. Which he should do. I mean, that's what you, you know, if you're at number three to one, you don't stand and fight. I'm surprised he didn't run away to begin with, to be honest. But this is quite annoying because we're not going to be able to hit them now. Damn, I left a gap. They don't seem to know what to do. They just kind of like trying to run through the, trying to run through the um, fortress. Let's just kill this guy off then. Yeah, you're too late, guys. We can't get them. They're escaping. No, not so good really. That wasn't really a very good result for us. I mean, we've driven them back, but I, I need to destroy these guys. I need to destroy the legions, the Imperial legions. I can't let them get away with this because they'll they'll concentrate. This is the trouble. <coughs> so maybe I need to not go more than two to one against them, and that gives them maybe the thought that they can advance. And what's going on here? Are we dying or something? Are we hitting our own guys? Some guys are under attack. They're gone. Right, might as well fast forward this because we're not going to catch them, I don't think. Very annoying. Didn't have enough cav to actually run after them and take them out. These Numidians, uh, the AI Numidians, are maybe doing a little bit of damage to them. Uh, not much. Oh, well. This is a. Well, we, you know, we killed 27 for nearly 200, so that's kind of alright, but not really, because I was setting this up to destroy these guys. It's interesting where they're going to run to. Let's try and spot where they retreat to. Let's hope they go north rather than south into further into Italy, mainland Italy. Let's try and pick up, look very closely when the game comes back. I hope that they head north, because I'm trying to get a, a, basically a, a line. I can move move through Italy, through the peninsula. Victory! Yeah, I didn't see where he went at all. I think he might have gone into Araminium, actually. Into here. Which, is that good or bad? Is that good or bad? Do we... Orders. Do we now besiege and hold on the river? I don't know. See, there's, there's possibilities holding on these rivers, on these river crossings. Mm, he's got three three legions coming through here. Um, why has this gone crazy? Because of that. Let's just take that down, and that'll be fine. These armies definitely need to move south. Um, Sir. Right. Okay. Sir. So this army needs to move to besiege here. It's a whole stack, so I'm not sure, quite sure that would Imperator. do it. What I'm saying is we, we might need two. Orders. 
Prepare for battle. Besieging settlement, sir. Settlement under siege, sir. Actually, that was wrong what I did there because this guy is not particularly Orders. loyal. So we should not have left him in charge of an army. Orders. Orders. Leaving the army. Move out. Orders. Prepare for battle. Besieging settlement, sir. Yeah, I've broke my own rules. I don't really like the idea of leaving guys in charge, to be honest. Leaving guys in charge of armies. Um, let's go. Where should we go? Should we just concentrate our forces? Keep saying I want to concentrate my forces and I'm trying to do too much with my men. Okay, what can we do here? That's very annoying. So we can get as far as Patavium. Let's go there. Right, uh, do we try and drive this guy back? So I think he probably would. Right, we're going to have to leave it a turn, I think. Got some more Numidians coming, another 20 minutes if they don't get killed, of course. Um, Okay, well I'm kind of kind of reasonably happy with that. These are nice and loyal, these two guys, actually. General Imperator. Let's bring them up to here. Let's keep all our guys together. They seem to be loyal. All right, this this worries me here because we've got a Praetorian Legion there that, that really we're we're going to be in trouble with, I think. Here, I think what I'm going to do is build one of those. And then here we'll garrison it, and then the general will move, will move north, I think. That will go this turn. Yeah, so I've got a slight worry now that I've left this guy in charge of a, a legion. He's not particularly loyal. So he might go over to the enemy, possibly. Quite sure that's going to work out in Eretium with the scapula. But I just thought I'd tie these guys down and maybe pull these legions down this this side of the Apennines. This is the Apennines here, these mountains, rather than this side. Because there's already one, two, three, four. These three legions come down to relieve here. That will release them from attacking Mediolanum, Torasia, Genoa, etc. Uh, yeah, I don't think there's much more I can do here. It's really just whether I'm going to try. And move these guys south. Now, do we move them south? Put someone in there and move them towards here, towards this bridge. I think maybe we do. Forward! I've got to be a bit more. I don't know what the word is? A bit more aggressive, I think. I need to put a guy in here. Orders. Oh, he's Orders. nice and loyal. Barely under under control. But this is uh, terrible. Well, oh, it's under growth. It's under growth now, so it's okay. I'll need I'll definitely need two armies, I think. Orders. I haven't got particularly high quality yeah. troops here, are I at all? For fighting um, legionaries, I mean. Where do I go from here? Because I see this will fall this turn, I think. Oops. Okay, that's all under control. So we move Sir. down here. Sir. Well, he can actually. Sir. He could besiege here. And this army can reach as well. There must be another legion here, I think. Maybe another two. Right, so we've got... To, oh, there's one there as well. God. General! So we can do a little bit of scouting. March! Oh my gosh. Um, right, so there's one, two, three legions. Possibly another one here. That's four. Orders. 
You gotta go for it. Attack! Besieging settlement, sir! Can't afford to be too passive, I don't think. Settlement under siege, sir! Sir! Attack! Besieging settlement, sir! Settlement okay. under siege, sir! That's quite a legion in there, to be honest. Um, whether we can do it or not, I don't really know. We need to... Wow, that's still under control. Barely, but it is under control. Sir. So if we bring these guys down as well... Sir. General. If we bring these these three General. leaders, maybe we can get down here, attack... Engage the enemy! Besieging settlement, sir! Take that city and then get back... Sir. I don't know, it's, we're asking a lot... Sir. to get back before these guys can take this city. These cities, these three north of, of the Seine. Yeah. Okay, I'm happy with that. So there's three legions there. We've got another guy here. General. And a lot of guys General. here. General. Though they're not particularly good troops. Um, there's one, two, three. There's three. There's four legions there. Four imperial legions. Okay, fair, fair enough. Okay, there's nothing more we can do there. Right, so let's. Um, I think we're going to end turn as far as Italy is. We're not going to do anything more here. Um, General! What we could do... We could try and hold up the the advance if we do things like this. Prepare fortification! Imperator! March! General! Like a lot of money, but hopefully it will hold them up on this river line. That's what that's what we're looking at. Orders. We have to go here, I think. There's a watchtower the other side. Yeah, no, I'm happy with that because that should uh, isolate those those units here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven legions north. That will give us a chance to take out Araminian, deal with these guys, deal with these. Deal with these, deal with these. Okay, no, I'm reasonably happy with that. There's a lot going on, but we're okay. Right. Okay, over in Greece, I think we were okay. General! We weren't going to worry too much about Sir. these generals, they seem pretty good. Don't know whether to go up here and build a fort here, actually, to hold them off. Sir! Build a fort here. Because this one is kind of in the wrong position now, to be honest. General! Onward! Ah, that's why I had him in there. Imperator! Splitting the troops! Okay, right, so I can't move these ships. These ships have moved as much as they can. They, they've got armies on board that have been um, evacuated from uh, the territories up here that are all going to fall. Let's get over to. Here, building legionaries here. These guys, I don't think I can move. Can these guys move. Sir. Oh yeah. Orders. Uh, so we can certainly move up the. Orders. Sir. Sir. General. Oh, we can't move up all the Imperator. Imperator. Um, Imperator. General. Orders. Imperator. It's important we make as much headway Imperator. as possible. So even though leaving them out in the open oh, no, is a slight problem. We're not going to worry about that. Um, what else is going on? Maybe we need to look at moving stuff around here, to be honest. Right, so he's moving in there. What's happening here? It's okay. I think we're at the end turn. I don't think there's anything else I, I can really do at the moment over here in the east. We're kind of waiting for the blooming Orders. Seleucid to attack us, to be honest. Um, not much we can do. Sir. Right, okay, let's Orders. just amalgamate Imperator. these guys up. Sir. Imperator. Imperator. General. Sir. 
Get them all into one tighter unit, tighter army. Okay. That's good. I'm feeling a lot happier about this frontier now, to be honest. It's pretty good. Okay. Um. Really know what to do with these guys, to be honest. Maybe I need some more scouts. few troops. Scouting. Right, I think I'm at the end turn. Do I'm just faffing around now. I don't think there's anything more I can do. We're probably going to lose a load more um, Oh gosh, we're slightly in the red. 3,000. Okay, let's see how things go. Let's see if anyone... Okay, well these were all expected. So we just need to, um, what has he got? He's got quite a lot of guys. He's got chariots, actually. OG Axeman. He's actually got quite a lot of guys in here. But we should be okay. Be careful here, we need to drop any siege equipment. We were, I don't think we're making any actually. We'll just move back away from the city. Yeah, I think that's the way to do it. Play cunning, move back. We could try, we'll try retreating immediately, exiting from the battle, and see if that. Um, He'll probably just attack us again. No, actually, we won't. We won't. We'll, we'll fight this. Let's pull these guys together. Well, this is a real siege army. Let's, uh, do we need to move anything? We do, I think. Archers for his chariots, I think. Let's fast forward this, but I really don't think he's got much chance. I'm not even sure these have got enough men to actually fire anymore. Let's just throw them in. guys in the middle of the... I just keep them here. Legionary cohort! Praetorian cohort! It's like we need to just protect Forward. our flank slightly. It's a 50-50, but I don't really think that that's correct. In fact, it looks slightly in their favour now. I don't quite know why these guys are so far back. City, so they'll, they'll attack us. Go 
Put the general back actually because I'm a bit worried about him being attacked. Okay, well, this is going better now. Okay, that's better. Weather's improved. actually going quite well. If we can deal with these guys, I think we'll be fine. speed just to try and get this this battle down battle done it's interesting it's still saying it's 50 50. Gonna have a problem here. I never actually set a time here on battles because you'll know when we're going to stop watch during battles. Um, I think they're going to run away if we go towards them. Wow, we've almost used up all of our. Right, see, I think he's just going to sit here. What I'm saying is, with the time limit, I think he's just going to sit here. Well, let's face it, we've got lots of, of guys, so it's not going to be a problem, to be honest. done to be honest. <clears throat> right, so I think they're they're doing well here these guys, but uh, Okay, that should work out okay for us I think. to get in there, those guys in the uh, gates. The general up actually. I think the gates are closed at the moment, so let's move up the... Towers. 
need to get inside the city. Okay, I think. Well, I can get these Praetorians in, to be honest. inside and capture the gates then we're fine. Take these guys in the flank. I think we've got the gates, I think. Okay, that's fine. That means we can get inside now. There's a bit of a battle going on over here, but I think we're going to be alright. Seems certain, okay, these Belgic heavy swordsmen, okay, we need to do something there. Let's get inside there, that's good. Let's run. We just need to hold here and then all these guys will run back into our guys. over this way I think. And once they run away of course they'll be hitting our guys as they <coughs> as we form up inside the gates. I mean this thing here is just firing at us the whole time. Very annoying. Yeah, this is the interesting battle over here. Um, 
don't really want the fighting to death, to be honest. What we want to do is move away and let them run. He's got some guys in the centre still, so we still need to deal with them. Let's move here. Let's go there. Let's go here. Start moving guys inside, I think. It's it's really a battle for the um the city, so we don't need to destroy his army. What we need to do is just get inside the fortress. I'm going to fast forward this again. You can see the power button saying that we've got the advantage. These guys are going to go around the back and come in through the other side. We should be okay. Once everyone's inside, we should be all right. The Spelgic swordsmen are a bit of a pain. We should get those to run away. Tired. Let's get, um, get inside the fortress. And hopefully the gates will close. as quickly as possible. Just these hundred odd um, guys now, but so we charge them. That'll keep them going maybe, get them um, Wavering. I think once this unit here hits them, that'll be the end of them. Let's push on. We don't really want to have to, to fight them all again. Let's fast forward again. Some chariots. Holding up quite well, to be honest, these guys. Uh, yeah, come back this way. You're just going to get hit by these towers. The enemy general flees. Press forward, so the spirit of his army is it's broken. It's a bit disappointing because I'm actually losing quite a lot of guys, quite a lot of infantry, and I'm going to need these to fight. Um... Waiting for orders. Let's just move on to the. area. Okay, this should be over quite quickly now. You can see the power button saying that we've, we've basically won. Very, very misty. All of a sudden. Okay, the general's gone. 
The enemy general is slain, and now his men fear us. It is time to press the attack. Is it? I think we've we won, haven't we? We've got some guys over here, possibly can cause us a problem. Why is it turning over to red? This guy here. In the battle. Okay, so we're just a thousand guys. That was, um, and this day is clearly that was quite heavy, to be honest. I mean, he had some heavy spearmen and stuff, but um, even so, that was not good. That was not a good tactical victory. We only we did very limited, really. We only have heavy infantry to fight. So obviously, their forte is melee, so they're going to take some losses. If we'd had more bowmen. We could have perhaps done some more damage without losing any guys. But, but good. This is the end of the Belgi in uh, Gaul. There's quite a lot of Belgi territory in Britain, but we need to just forget about Victory! that for the moment. We're not going to be able to Settlement captured! do much about that. Okay, so I haven't seen any more cities or any armies go blue, which is good. Okay, so what we can do is auto-resolve that. That was always going to be a bridge too far to hold that, I think, cap up. Kebab blacker. Oh, this is interesting. They defeat. Damn. This is good. Is this uh, your forces ambush the rebel forces? So okay, just retreat. Oh, I should have taken that then. Damn. Okay. They defeat. Retreat. Where's he going? So it's going back to Pinaka, is he? Well, that was all right. We didn't seem to lose any cities other than those I was expecting. So, gosh, where does that come from? Where does this come from? So, disorder. Construction report. So we've got a fortress in Alexandria. Let's go to Alexandria actually. I've got a feeling I can only build, Let's build a courier and then we can get. Um, yeah, I can only build these guys now until we build the courier. So we'll just build loads of Nabataeans. I need to move these guys on. Let's do that to begin with. We need to move towards here. Moves here. Sir, and these guys need to move up as well. Sometimes moving through cities they seem to get a bonus in movement somehow. Let's move through near a Slimia. Uh, these guys here will move up as well. Okay, so we've got plenty of reinforcements, sir. Uh, a couple of legions, well, I'll say plenty. A couple of legions coming over. General. We need to, uh, this guy is completely Orders. disloyal, so he's of no use at all. We can use him to do a bit of scouting. Let's go here. Right, okay, well, I can't. oh gosh, there's some, uh, there's some stuff coming towards us, which is a bit disappointing. Sir. Um, right, well, I'm kind of jumping all over this place. Let's have a look. Pontus is the most advanced. Right, so we need a, a, a guy in here. How can we do this? Sir. These guys still loyal? They are quite loyal. Uh, not brilliantly loyal, but they're kind of okay. Wow, actually, one, two, three, four, five legions have moved up that way, which is good. That's really good. So we can now. General! We can now maybe do something here, you know? I think things are looking up. Things are looking not quite so bad. Or well, saying that. Oh my gosh, there's one, two legions. Right, uh, oof. Let's look in this city we just took, first of all. Let's look at... Uh, 
Right, recruit. We didn't damage anything there. That was weird. I'm sure, would would have damaged something. Yeah, we lost a lot of guys here. I was hoping we'd have um, quite a lot left of these guys, but it doesn't look as if that's going to be the way. Let's go the other way. This, I think, we can disband because it's um, it can't actually attack. It doesn't have a meth enough guys left in it to actually attack anyone. Okay. Um, so what do we got here? What can we do? We've got to. I say we've got to focus our forces. Not sure, he can actually relieve here at the moment. Um, oh gosh, our money dropped a lot, didn't it? There. One hundred and six thousand in the red. That's no good. Um, hmm. We've got to make the most of this like leeway, but this Simbri is not attacking us. We've got to do something here, I think. We've got to try and reduce these three legions down. There's two legions here. Let's do what we know we've got to do anyway. We could move these guys up to here. March! Out of move, sir! General! Can you reach here? March! Imperator! Imperator! Well, still in a horrible situation. Even with low taxation. That's going to rebel. Oh no, has a rebellion sped to. Has it spread? Shuffle guys around, I think. I mean, they're not fantastically loyal, they're not particularly brilliant governors, but they'll do at the moment. So we've got one, two. Hmm. We've got, um, one, two, three, four, maybe five legions up there, haven't we? in there. So that's going to fall, isn't it? We need to deal with this legion, which I think we can possibly do now. But these guys have retained their loyalty, which is excellent. Being outside the city, they seem to pick out, not pick up so much disloyalty. These have not done anything. So we can maybe take Capua. Take this first, actually. Attack! Uh, I'm going to risk an auto resolve. Okay, well, that, that's fine. That's actually probably what we might have lost anyway, to be honest. Let's destroy these guys. Let's occupy it, actually. I was going to destroy it for a moment, but um, oh gosh, this is what I was saying to you about. General. This guy is now a, a rebel general. Out of move, sir. 80, that's not good. Need to repair stuff here. Went to growth. Now we need to move the army out. And then we're going to need to attack here, I think. Imperator. Um. Best way to do this. You certainly do not do not want to leave all these guys here. General. Let's um. Imperator, leaving the army. March. Onward. Imperator. Just gonna leave them up. Just gonna leave. Um. He's ever carte. General. Hmm. We maybe need another legion here to attack. Imperator. Yeah, 
Yeah, I think so. That's what we need to do. Daryl. And these two here. Daryl. Well, they do have Daryl. a Numidian army coming ashore. Fleet ready. Let's land on the port here. Aye, aye, Captain. Splitting the troops. All ashore. Send that back to collect more guys. Aye, aye, Captain. I'm gonna have to keep them. Yes, Captain. Aye, aye, Captain. Damn, we can't yes, quite Captain. reach. Um. Yes, Captain. Yes, Captain. So maybe each no turn we'll get a. Aye, Captain. Set sail. A legion arriving in row. Half of it will be Numidians, half it will be legionaries. Still going on looking at the city grows. Coralia. I can't afford to build anything there. Octavium. Oh, that's fine, it's okay. So this could go this turn. Start getting things back. Wow, this is going to rebel. All these things that have um, been damaged. It's down to zero public order. Okay, uh, well, I can only deal with the problems that I can deal with at the moment. Knew about Elephantine. 24,000 in the red. Still gives 167,000, so yeah. Give a blanker has been occupied. A Varicum. So we've now got this kind of a. Uh, if you look at the mini map, we've got this kind of area of uh, Imperial forces. Something over here. Still can't see any. Well, there are some Seleucid troops coming forwards now. Orders. Go here. Ah, oh, that's um. Orders, sir. Orders, Imperator. There's some more troops in here. Wow, that is um so on the cusp of going over. I think we can move many more guys out of here. To be honest, it's um. They're not pretty much rubbish to be honest to, to look after it. Right, so this is this is worrying. He could be going to attack us. That's quite possible. Um, I'm going to have to do a loyalty check on all the on all my cities again, which is a little bit annoying. But so having said that, Imperator. I'm reasonably happy with this now. Out of move, sir. Imperator. Onward. Ambush in place! Onward! Out of move! So save some of these guys, not that they're particularly fantastic numbers of troops, but they'll they'll do. Um Yeah, although these have gone over to rebel cities, we've got a, a continuous band of cities that are gonna isolate the Sumatians. I hope that the just look at things di diplomatic wise, I hope the Roman rebels have not Where are they? Roman rebels, why didn't they come up? Okay, so they're, they're allies with Macedon and Ptolemaic. They're not allies with the Sumatians at the moment. Well, so that's fine. As long as that continues, we'll, that would have done us quite a lot of good, actually. Um, I've got to look at this because he looks quite menacing. Might be elephants, actually, in that army, quite possibly. There's the Lucids. They've got territory in India. It's looking a bit... How long before this can arrive? Onward! Forward! Ooh, gosh, it's going to be about three moves, three turns before we can get reinforcements here. And probably even more before these guys can arrive. Onward! Forward! Orders! Move out! Okay, well, <clears throat> yeah, things could be worse. And we can move these guys in now, can't we? Aye. These guys can land. 
got to basically bring our forces ashore. Bring them here. Set sail off the boat. Impertial. This guy. I think he was never actually loyal at all. That guy. So these guys are really poor. They're going to need to spend their time inside the Fleet fortress. How far can this get? Aye, aye, Captain. That's it. So we Move need to guard that sir. ship. We're going to put some more ships by yes, it. Yes, Captain. Aye, Captain. This guy can go here. Yes, Captain. Off the boat. Imperator. And the ship can go. Aye, Captain. To guard this one. Aye, aye, Captain. Still got some guys on board here. Aye, Captain. Actually, a lot of guys, actually, and a litter boss, so that's quite important we hang on to that. Um, okay, what's going on here? So I'm quite happy now that we've got quite a lot of troops here. We've got some very disloyal generals. Scipio has become quite disloyal, which is a bit of a pain, really, a bit sad. Imperator. So you need to put more very disloyal generals to one side. Can we build more stuff in Sparta? Gosh, that's good. So soon we'll go for Civitas and then we'll get um, I mean, import. Might be able to build a fortress possibly soon. That could be that could be handy. Maybe get legionaries in Sparta, that'd be excellent. See, we're making a huge amount of money here. 20,000, 13,000. I mean, this is like, if you look at some of these other cities here, four fives. I mean, it's nowhere near. I mean, even Rome is only two. Right. Okay, I think the next episode is going to be very interesting because we're going to fight some of these big sieges. Certainly, Aruminium will fall three against one. Uh, we've got a big siege here we're going to have to do. I think we'll maybe take out this army first. This will go fall as well. This I think we're going to attack. Well, actually, we'll probably just continue with that at the moment. Orders. Yeah, I think so. We'll bring this army up to take part in the siege here. It's my first thoughts. The um, certainly over here, there's going to be a massive battle. There's three legions against three here, but that that really doesn't tell all the tale. We've got some more troops we can bring in, I think that we're going to have to bring in. This is obviously going to go over to... It's only got 35%. Mind you, we can destroy stuff, can't we? Let's destroy some stuff. That'll help. It's down to 60 now, which is so good. I don't think about some of these things. They can't. They can't actually be destroyed. And so, so 60 is not good. Still red. So we may have just to evacuate that and attack over here and destroy these guys. Yeah, we've got to do that quickly because say we've we've driven back the Simbri, but um, they'll be back in winter. During the next turn, they'll come back and attack us. I'm pretty so sure that's what's going to happen. And we've still got to. Decide what to do with these. Um, in here, not much. Well, I think we've got to come up and try and relieve uh, Gagovia, to be honest. Certainly, Bribact is going to be the place we've got to attack, I think. See if we can reduce these guys down. That's going to decimate our forces on the Rhine, so we might lose some territory to the Simbri, that's quite possible. There's at least five legions north of the Po, this river here. But I'm fairly confident. It's annoying, we can't actually reach that. We can reach here with these guys, these two <clears throat> Lither boss, so we can attack straight away. But to be honest, it's, it's you know <clears throat> it's probably better to actually keep the siege going and hit the armies that are outside. Logically, because the, the armies that are inside are gradually going to reduce down and then they're at a disadvantage when they try and attack us. So I think that's maybe what we're going to do. Maybe try and take out some of the, the armies that are loose. So like this would be worth taking. 
that was um, going to be quite an easy city to take. Uh, maybe we'll concentrate on this army and this army and this one, these three. But anyway, that's the end of the episode. We've done quite a lot, as, uh, as I said. We've, um, I'm a lot happier with things in Italy now. It looks to me as if we've maybe got um, a chance of taking back some of these cities. Uh, and we're certainly in a better position here now. We've got these armies on Sir. shore. Orders. Uh, we've got quite a lot of troops here. Sir. Again, but still there's another group of troops still to come. We haven't got much in the way of heavy infantry, Orders. but we can we can always hire stuff. These pets is at Taroy. Pretty good. Levy pikemen. So we've got a chance. Okay, thanks for time watching. I'll be speaking to you very soon. Bye-bye for now. Bye-bye.